Hello and welcome to Maths with Jacob. This lesson will focus on even numbers. Recognising even numbers in everyday life is a very important skill and children need to understand the importance of this topic. Consider the following number of oranges. How many are there? It's clear to see that there are two oranges. It is quite easy to work out whether 2 is an even number. Now here's an important rule which helps us to work out whether a number is even. An even number of objects can be shared evenly between two people so that nothing is left over. Let us use the above rule to determine whether two oranges represent an even number. Can we share two oranges between two people so that nothing is left over. Yes, and here's how we do it. Here's one orange and here's another orange. So one person gets one orange, the other person gets another orange, so each person receives one orange and there is nothing left over. So that tells us that two is an even number. Consider the following number of apples. Can we share the four apples between two people so that nothing is left over? Yes, one person gets two and the other person gets two. Each person receives two apples, there is nothing left over, so four is an even number. Another important rule. All even numbers can be divided into pairs of two. For example, here we have eight marbles. Look at how we divide the above eight marbles into pairs of two. That is four pairs of two. One pair, two pairs, three pairs, four pairs. <coughs> Excuse me. Altogether, there are eight marbles, all grouped into pairs, and there's nothing left over, which tells us that eight is an even number. Example 1. Give two reasons why 10 is an even number. Solution. Let us represent 10 by the 10 buttons below. So here are 10 buttons, that represents the number 10. This is the first reason why 10 is an even number. The above buttons can be divided into two equal groups with nothing left over. So there's one group here, there's another group here, they're both even because they have five in them. <clears throat> when I say even, there's the same number of buttons in each group. That gives us the reason, the first reason why 10 is an even number, because you can divide it into two groups where each group has the same number of objects. The second reason is this. The 10 buttons can be divided into 5 equal pairs of 2. 1 pair, 2 pairs, 3 pairs, 4 pairs, 5 pairs, and there are no leftovers. There's nothing is left over. So there's the second reason why 10 is an even number. So in summary, even numbers can be divided into 2 equal groups with nothing left over. Also, even numbers can be divided into pairs of two with nothing left over. So here's a simple rule for recognizing even numbers. Doesn't matter what they are. Even numbers are easy to recognize if we remember the following. All even numbers end in 0, 2, 4, 6 or 8. So if any number ends in any of those numbers there, it is even. Examples. All the following numbers are even because they end in either 0, 2, 4, 6 or 8. So look at these numbers. 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 240, 352, 564, 376, 938, etc, etc. You can go on forever. As long as the numbers end in one of these digits here, and they all do, that means the numbers are even. So that's a very simple way how you recognize whether a number is even. 